are amazing. They are your battle wounds showing that you're a fighter and that you can survive whatever life had to throw at you. People think that scars should be your weakness, but I think my scars are my biggest strength. I have quite a lot of scars on my face, my hands, my hip, from various operations. But scars aren't always a physical thing. Scars can also be emotional. Whether you have physical scars or emotional ones, I want to let you know that you're beautiful. Your scars don't make you who you are, they don't define you, but they are a part of you. They have shaped you to be the person you are today, they're part of your story, and I think they're amazing. I just thought I'd share with you today what my scars mean to me. As well as proving, obviously, you know, I've had surgery, I've recovered, I've survived, I have been a fighter, you know, like I said before, they also help to prove to me on my toughest days that I will be able to get through it. Tough times never last, but tough people do. One of my most all-time favourite quotes. I like to remind myself of it quite often. The fact that you have scars, emotional or physical, just reminds you that you're strong and that you have got over something, you've overcome it and you're still here today. As I said, I have scars on my face and inside scarring in my mouth and nose and things. Um, I'll see if I can find a picture from when I was younger because my scars got a lot more prominent on my face when I was younger. They've definitely faded over the years. I'm not sure if you can even really see them anymore on my lip. And I also have scars on my hand. This one is one of my favourites. It is a Z scar from my Z Plasty. And me and my friends like to call it my little Harry Potter scar. Um, I also have a Z on one of my other fingers somewhere too. I don't know if you can really see it. Sometimes I do get a bit self-conscious about my scars, you know, it's not always this positive having scars But it's normal, you know, everyone is self-conscious about something on their body But most people I know have scars, whether emotional or physical So you have every right to feel self-conscious about your scars But there is no need to because, you know, they're amazing It is perfectly understandable to feel self-conscious about your scar from time to time but please just remember that it's what makes you the strong, amazing, beautiful person you are. The scars can also help you reflect too. You can reflect on the bad times and just see how you pushed through and managed to get where you are today. Speaking of reflecting, I just want to say a massive thank you to everyone who's watched my videos this year. I know 2020 hasn't really been the best year for us all, but you have all honestly made my year by watching these videos, leaving me comments, and it has just been so amazing. In particular, I'd like to thank my two new friends who I made through YouTube this year, and that is Aurora and Maddie. If you're watching, thank you so, so much. You have honestly helped me through so much, and just by watching these videos and knowing that I have your support means the world to me. I'm also very thankful that I do have the scars that I have, because without them, I don't think I'd be the same person. I love my scars and I'm proud to be me. I hope I've helped you see that you should be proud to be you too. Remember, you're braver than you believe, stronger than you think, more beautiful than you could ever imagine and love more than you know. And your scars are amazing. Merry Christmas.